Let's work with gRPC in Postman. Under the New button, select gRPC Request. You can see this feature is still in beta. The first thing you'll need is to enter a server URL. You can also configure whether or not you want a secure or unsecured connection and select a method. gRPC supports four different methods. There's unary, a traditional request response pattern, server streaming, client streaming, and bidirectional streaming. Let's start with unary. I'm not that familiar with this endpoint, so I'm not going to compose a message yet, but I know that I don't require any kind of authorization, and I'm not planning on sending any other metadata. If the server supports server reflection, then Postman will automatically fetch the schema. Otherwise, you can upload a proto file or create a new protobuf API in the sidebar under APIs. Let's go ahead and invoke our request, and on the bottom we can see the server response and all the metadata associated with that. Let's go to the Message tab, and again, I'm not really sure what the payload should be formatted as, but I can generate an example message under this EG. Okay, so here's an example message with some placeholder data. I'm going to update the string and invoke our request and again, inspect on the bottom. Let's take a look at a different method. Let's take a look at client streaming. Okay, so once again, I'll invoke my request, and you can see I've sent a request to my server URL, and the interface has changed ever so slightly. And now I can go ahead and send a request, send another request, and another one, and in this case, my server is waiting for a bunch of client requests to come in before sending a response. The last thing we'll do is save this request to a collection. This example was client streaming, and we'll save it in a new collection called gRPC examples. And now that I have this collection, I can share this with my colleagues um, and my teammates can add more examples. This feature is still in the beta, so make sure you share your feedback with the engineering team and there's new features releasing soon. Mm -hmm.